Hi, welcome back. So this is one of the simple uh, scenario illustration. If you see this sample trip for customer stock delivery, if you see this one, right? So this is the plant. This is the place. This we will call it as departure point. So here I would like to mention something called shipping point. Shipping point is the place where you will do your picking, loading, and you know your transportation planning activities. So suppose if you would like to send the stock from this plant, material one and two, suppose your customer ordered, okay? So from this plant, so we'll try to choose the mode of transport. This is, uh, for example, you can see this picture. This is via road. This is the truck, okay? So then it is sending to your customer, okay? This is the sample example we'll try to see in our further discussions, okay? So let's, uh, what are all the scenarios we can able to create actually, possibility. So if you see, if you think this, this is a truck from one plant to one customer. If you think that this is plant and this is the customer location, it can be individual customer or a physical location, okay? Shipment from one plant to several customers. For example, this is the plant indicator. You can see you can able to send to three different customers. The truck is going one, one to one addresses okay shipment by rail from vendor to plant okay if you purchase a certain stock through rail uh, you can able to receive the stock here this is the blue color indicator is you can imagine plant and this is a green ones from customers okay in the similar way if customer is returning because of xyz reason maybe uh, it is spoiled or demolished or else uh, any other reason okay blocked stock Okay, so such a case as customer will do the empty return. Sometimes he will do carton boxes or pallets. So he has to return based on the, you know, agreement between customer and plant company. You can see this. These are the, from two plants. Okay, several plants to the several customers using different modes of transport. Yeah, on a brief, we've talked about First scenario is individual shipment. The same thing individually, okay? So like, you know, the same shipment can able to send to collective customers in individual, you can able to send to one customer or else in one shipment, you can able to include one delivery or different deliveries for the same customer, okay? Collective means all shipments together for different customers or the same customer. Okay, multi-mode transport means like uh, first step, it will go via, you know, air flight and next it will go to the train or else road. These kind of examples will be there. So this is not not much easy how we are looking at. It has, it has its own complexity to derive the same thing on the system actually. Okay, so I think you got a sample illustration and uh, the possibility of scenarios we'll look into it, this scenario okay for our understanding for end-to-end -end process thank you we'll catch up in next session